Hey y'all, welcome back to Pancakes and Pandemonium. So guess what? I decided to check out Sam's Club. I'm gonna bring you guys with me. I have it. So the title's gonna be like, first time Sam's Club. It's been like 15 years, 10 years. I don't know, since I've had a Sam's Club membership. It's been a while. Let's go see what they have. But my car is air conditioned, so. <laughs> All right. I decided it was time to try Sam's Club. I keep seeing different bloggers, different influencers talk about it and comparing. A lot of people have both memberships. Y'all know I love Costco, but I've been hearing some things are cheaper at Sam's. Sam's has different variety, different things. So I decided to go check it out today and. Come in. So I've officially lost my mind. About $630 worth, but I did get some stuff for birthday boxes. I got some stuff for Sasha. Um, I got Ryan some stuff he needs. He needed some t-shirts and shorts. So, you know, this isn't like my normal, but it was still a good time. Let's get into it. So one of the boxes fell. We got sushi, that was one of the things. I know, I keep hearing sushi's coming to Costco, but ours doesn't have it. So here, we typically go close up. Um, the box fell, so it's not pretty anymore, but we did get some sushi. We like all the fancy sushis, but Mason's been trying it and so has Ryan. So I got just plain old California rolls for, those just being introduced to it. So we got that. And then this isn't pretty either. This is like Mexican street corn dip and it had the fixings on one side and then, so you mix it all together and you bake it in the oven. That's gonna go in the fridge and we're gonna eat that with sliders tomorrow night. This was under eight bucks for two and they're like five, five to seven bucks depending on the store for this size. The Greek yogurt was $4.28, so I got Greek yogurt. I love different like trail mix and stuff. M mostly, mostly I use them to top off um, yogurt bowls, but this is the Omega Powerhouse trail mix and it's got strawberries, granola, it's got walnuts, almonds, banana, it's got all kinds of good stuff. So I got that. Okay, guys, they had these. Now, here's the deal. Lance has to share Father's Day this year because it's also our 23rd wedding anniversary. Happens every few years. But of course, we're still gonna get him some things and he's been using the Traeger more and more and more. He especially uses it this time of year. So he had this big barbecue prep tub. And if you see, like it's got like the cutting board and the tub to marinate and I don't know, it's really cool. And it was around 15 bucks. So I got this. I got this for Lance. If you've been with me for a while, you know my kids, especially Ryan, love these teriyaki beef, like ramen-esque bowls. And this was under eight bucks for, what is that, a 12? Eight pack, which it was 7.49, I think, which made them cheaper than Dollar Tree, which is where I normally get them. I thought the strawberry vanilla checks would be fun to try. I, they had these really yummy, Cinnamon Toast Crunch and Funfetti Soft Baked Cookies. This is a 28 pack. I've never seen these at Costco. Uh, ranch Veggie Straws are a Powell family favorite. We got a big bag of those. Croutons, it's, it's a must. This looked really fun. If y'all know from my other hauls, we love popcorn. And yes, we buy microwavable popcorn and stuff too but it's fun to buy the flavors. So I got sour cream and onion smart food. I wanna just go put it away. And Nutella Go was about a dollar to, about a dollar cheaper than it is at Costco. My kids love these and I don't buy them very often, but again, the, 
the Ritz Handy Snacks, another fun item for summer snacks. This is one of Lance's favorite things. I'll actually probably put these away with the prep, the barbecue prep for Father's Day. Ritz crackers, a must. I mean, snacks to eat with Nutella, peanut butter crackers, tuna salad, chicken salad. We need all the crackers. And by the way, my kids, comment down below and tell me if your kids are the same. My kids think a sleeve of crackers is an individual serving. So, I've never seen goldfish crisps and sour cream and onion. Again, I thought these would be a really fun snack item this summer. To be honest. My kids love peanut butter crackers, cheese crackers, all of this. And you guys, if you've been with me for a while, you know my husband, I think I've said his name a couple times already. We had to. <laughs> Lance really loves trail mix, especially the ones with M&Ms. He's a veteran. He's a disabled veteran. We're, we just had Memorial Day. We're getting into all of the patriotic holidays. Red, white, and blue trail mix, a must. Z-bars, my kids love. Lance is predispositioned to diabetes. And last year he was diagnosed pre-diabetic. We got that diagnosis reversed. His numbers fall just under the number where they diagnose prediabetes. So we're still, you know, trying to make sure, you know, high protein, lowish carb, not a lot of sugar. So meat sticks are a good item to pack in his lunches for an extra hit of protein. Cold brew, it's that time of year. These are prime rib sliders, you guys. I've been seeing other people come with those. Um, I have a small army of minions, so uh, we needed more than one pack to get everyone fed properly. But this will be a fun summery dinner. This was the first thing I grabbed. Just summer, summer break, cut down on dishes, fun summer paper plates. Um, I've perfected my crab salad recipe, and the girls are dying for more, so I got two big packs. I'll either make two small packs of crab salad or one big weekend thing. I haven't decided yet, but I got two things of imitation crab. Guys, raspberries. These were $1.97. 87. $1.87 at Sam's Club for the two pack of raspberries. They're huge. Yeah, and look, look how like, so I'm excited to dive into those. Yogurt bowls, snacks, all the things. Y'all know I love my green chili powder and I haven't ordered more. I've been needing to. And then I saw this at Sam's Club. It's garlic powder, onion powder, hatch green chili powder. It's, you know, some salt. So I thought, oh, we'll try that guy. Um, I love Kinders. I still have some buttery seasoning from a while back when y'all saw me get some on clearance at Walmart. Um, so I didn't need any of that, but they had a cherry cola and a bourbon peach seasoning. I got a two pack of these. I actually split these uh, with my friend Andrea. So one for my dog, one for her dog. While Mason and Emily are getting bigger, they still enjoy some kids specific products. I've never seen these. I thought they would be fun for them to try. Everyone is on puzzle kicks and these look so fun. Thousand piece puzzles, some good activity for hot days for the kids to keep them off screens. We got some books. And since kids are in the room, I'm not gonna say who's for what. They're just gonna go in my closet and put away to pull out either for board boxes or birthdays. My kids love Five Nights at Fre Freddy's. That's a book pack. Okay, it's the math. Book full of cheesy jokes. The grossest joke book ever written. 12 year old boy jokes. A Pokemon epic sticker book. How to draw Harry Potter. The younger ones are starting to get into Harry Potter. Harry Potter paint by water. Taylor Swift coloring activity book. It's got all kinds of cute stuff in it, including pictures that can be used as posters. And then I'm not gonna go through each one individually, but Ryan is has been working and it can be really hard for autistic kids, young adults finding stuff they like and he didn't want shorts because he said they're, they're, they're too tight and they bug him. 
but I found some like sweats. He wears sweats. He likes soft stuff a lot. So I found a couple pairs of really soft sweats in materials of pants that he wears. So I got him a few pairs of shorts. These are Puma. Just really soft material. So they're not binding and they don't feel foreign. So hopefully he, he'll wear those. And then a few t-shirts because um, he goes to work a couple times a week and he, he needs some cooler breathable clothes. Last but certainly not least, you probably saw me pass this earlier, another dog, set of dog toys for Sash. It is like a cute little camp summer campfire s'more set. I'm sure she'll love it. Okay, you guys, it's a massive haul. Like I said, it was $629, but it wasn't my typical grocery haul. Clothes, birthday toys, you know, all the things. It's, I think I'm a fan of Sam's Club. Most things were very comparable, if not cheaper, to Costco, like I said. Um, different variety of things. Uh, I think I can see a place for two. It'll be great to swap, you know, maybe we'll do Costco, Sam's, maybe we'll just find our regulars. I don't know. We're just gonna have to get into a groove, but I think I'm a fan. So on that note, kids are hungry. The girls are dying to jump into the sushi. Gotta get some of the freezer stuff and fridge stuff put away. So do me a favor, if you haven't yet, like this video, subscribe, and you know what? Come back for more pancakes and pandemonium. We'll see you soon.